Grace Omar Kay filed a lawsuit in Los Angeles accusing Christian Combs, son of Sean Diddy Combs, of sexual assault during a yacht trip at the end of 2022. The suit alleges that the trip, advertised as a family excursion, turned into a hedonistic environment. Christian is accused of sexual assault, harassment, and emotional distress. Sean Combs is sued for premises liability and aiding his son. Both have denied the allegations. Attorney Tyrone Blackburn stated, like father, like son, referencing Sean Combs' alleged pattern of behavior. In her lawsuit, Grace claims that Christian Combs sexually assaulted her after allegedly drugging her. She provided audio transcripts purportedly capturing her refusal of his advances while he allegedly groped her. Grace, then 25, worked as a steward on the yacht, where she observed partying, drug use, and interactions with suspected sex workers and celebrities. She alleges that alcohol bottles may have been laced with drugs, causing women to exhibit concerning behavior. She was informed that Christian Combs would be joining the party to record music with producer Rodney Lil Rod Jones in the yacht studio around December 28, 2022. According to the lawsuit, Christian, who had been staying on shore at a villa, frequently joined his father in the evenings on the yacht. The suit alleges that he arrived heavily intoxicated and paid undue attention to the woman. Christian then pressured Grace to take shots of tequila that she believes he brought on board. After she consumed the shot, Christian became aggressive and insisted she drink more. Grace began to feel the effects of the tequila and suspected it had been spiked. The situation escalated as Christian groped Grace's legs, breasts, and private areas. The lawsuit cites audio recordings in which Grace declines alcohol, expresses the need to leave, and tells Christian Combs to stop touching her, with kissing noises audible in the background. The audio recordings were made by Rodney Lil Rod Jones, who was in the studio during the alleged assault, and claims in his own lawsuit that he was required to constantly record Sean Combs and his staff, capturing hours of footage allegedly depicting criminal conduct. News outlets has allegedly heard two audio clips transcribed in the suit purportedly from the night of December 28, 2022, but has not independently verified the identities of those recorded. In one clip, Grace is heard expressing discomfort with Christian Combs touching her legs, while he insists she stay with him. Grace refuses, citing the need to speak with a crew leader, knowing they would be unavailable at the time. Christian Combs allegedly continued to make advances towards Grace O'Marquet, insisting on her assistance and making inappropriate comments. She tried to focus on her work, but Combs allegedly found her again and pressured her to find him a place to sleep. When she directed him to the yacht cinema, he allegedly blocked her in and began to grope her, eventually attempting to force her into performing oral sex. Grace fought him off until someone else entered the area. The suit includes photos of bruising on Omar Kay's forearm, allegedly caused by Combs grabbing her. Grace Omar Kay's lawsuit alleges that the assault had a profound impact on her mental health, professional life, and personal well-being. When she reported the incident to the yacht captain, she claims her complaints were dismissed and she faced retaliation, ultimately leading to her termination. Grace experienced severe mental health issues, including anxiety, panic attacks, and self-termination thoughts, as well as physical health problems like an eating disorder and epileptic seizures. Seeking unspecified damages, she aims to advocate for others in similar situations. Omar Kay's attorney commended her bravery in coming forward and hopes her story will encourage others to speak out. Grace Omar Kay's lawsuit against Christian Combs marks the first accusation of sexual assault against him. Meanwhile, Sean Combs, Christian's father, has faced similar accusations from four women since November, with one suit settled and the others pending resolution. Additionally, a producer named Jones, who worked for Sean Combs, alleged sexual harassment and coercion to engage in sexual acts, along with witnessing Combs providing drinks laced with drugs at parties. Combs' attorney dismissed Jones's claims as reckless name-dropping and pure fiction. Homeland Security investigations conducted searches on Sean Combs' properties in Los Angeles and Miami on March 25th. The investigation, which began earlier, was aware of the property layout before the raids. During the searches, federal agents found guns and seized Combs' phones under a warrant from the U.S. District Court for the Southern District of New York. Christian Combs was detained during the Los Angeles search but not arrested. Authorities are also investigating allegations of statutory rape against Sean Combs. Federal investigators have interviewed at least three women and one man regarding allegations of sex trafficking, sexual assault, and involvement in illegal narcotics and firearms distribution related to Sean Combs. Diddy's attorney, Aaron Dyer, 
stated that Diddy cooperated with authorities during last month's property searches, emphasizing that Diddy was never detained. Dyer labeled the search as an ambush and criticized the rush to judgment based on meritless accusations from civil lawsuits, asserting that there has been no determination of criminal or civil liability. Dyer maintains Diddy innocence and vows to continue fighting to clear his name. Combs, once a revered figure in the music industry, has been increasingly scrutinized following multiple accusations of sexual assault. These allegations have had significant repercussions, causing Diddy to step back from various business ventures. Despite the mounting allegations and investigations, Diddy continues to deny any wrongdoing and vows to clear his name. The world watches as this saga unfolds, waiting for justice to prevail. We've delved into the serious allegations against Sean Diddy Combs and his son Christian Combs, including claims of sexual assault and misconduct. This lawsuit, the first to accuse Christian Combs, is not an isolated event but a part of a broader narrative, with Sean Combs facing similar accusations from four other women. These allegations are not without consequences. Federal officials have raided Sean Combs' properties in Los Angeles and Miami, indicating a deepening of the investigation. As we've seen, this situation has already impacted Sean Combs' business ventures, leading to his stepping down from several positions. The potential implications for both their careers are profound, with public sentiment and legal repercussions playing significant roles. As we continue to follow this story, we invite you to join the conversation. Subscribe, like, and comment on this video to stay updated on this situation.